the early 1980s, featured one of the fastest growing segments of aviation, that of ultralight aircraft. Over 40 years have passed, with many of the aircraft introduced during this time, still safely flying today, and being offered for sale on the used ultralight market. This series of short video clips, gives information on the ultralight flyer's recommendation for aircraft that we have flown, owned and or built. All of these aircraft still have manufacturers producing parts, for their repair and continued airworthiness. In this segment we will take a quick look at the Hyperlite SNS-8. The Hyperlite SNS-8 was originally designed by Sorrel Aviation, at the request of Ron Shetler the first Canadian distributor of Rotax aircraft engines. It was originally designed to be powered by the Rotax 277 single-cylinder, 28-horsepower two-stroke engine using a Heger belt reduction drive. In truth the SNS-8 is a smaller version of the Sorrel Hyperbipe. The SNS in the name stands for Sorrel Negative Stagger. The SNS-8 is offered in kit form. It features a two-piece 4130 welded steel fuselage, which can be separated for ease of storage. The aircraft can be covered in pre-sewn Dacron sail cloth envelopes or by the use of standard aircraft covering materials. Building times are in the 150 to 400 hour range, with the conventional fabric covering taking longer to complete. The craft is a tail dragger, staggerwing, biplane, in a tractor configuration. It uses standard stick and rudder three axis controls, with full span flaperons on the lower wing, a center mounted stick, and left hand throttle. For the best performance, a Rotax 377 or 447 two stroke engine is recommended. Other engines that have powered the Hyperlite SNS 8 are Hearth, Kawasaki, and half VW conversion. Climb rate comes in at around 750 feet per minute, cruise is 55 to 65 miles per hour, stall comes in at 27 miles per hour. If considering purchasing a used Hyperlite SNS 8, it is the ultralight flyer's recommendation that the plane's fabric be tested, the airframe, wings, landing gear, and the control systems be thoroughly inspected. If the history of the engine is unknown, it is recommended that the exhaust be removed and the pistons inspected for wear and seizure. At the time of production of this video, the ultralight flyer would estimate the value of a used Hyperlite SNS 8 from the 1980s to be worth between $4,500 and $6,500. The Ultralight Flyer also recommends that the buyer contact Thunderbird Aviation at www.thunderbirdaviationme.com to inquire about any modifications or updates that the factory might recommend.